two common ways people mess up with chastity. One, they go and get a cage that everyone else seems to be getting, thinking that, oh, it must be a great cage. When in fact, that's not true. You have to research your own chastity cage. Don't just get the one cage that everybody else seems to be wearing and thinking, oh, it must be amazing. People have different needs for chastity. Some people want short term, some people want long term. It all depends on what is best for you, your body and your skin. Always bear in mind skin irritation. So you've got choices of metal, resin, plastic. You really need to look into it and find out what cage is best for you. Two, they don't look after themselves or their cage. Hygiene is so important for a healthy chastity journey and making sure that you keep it clean is really important. I've just done a YouTube video on the how, how to have a healthy chastity journey, so go and check it out, but make sure guys you are keeping it clean.